to rest our ears from the ever-present pop singers, jazz hipsters and raucous pelvis swivelers, we go back a hundred years or so to antique music boxes. As the expert on the subject, we introduce Mr. Samuel Sunley of London, who has inherited from his forebears a love of music boxes, old and new. For six generations, the family has made, repaired and collected fine examples of these fascinating mechanisms. In the years before gramophones, radio and TV, the only sources of music were either a musical instrument or a music box. In Switzerland, if you wanted to sit back and listen, this was the answer. Apart from his valuable collection of antiques, Mr. Sunley has kept busy making modern items in the shape of tankards, cigarette boxes, compacts and even teapots. This gypsy girl with a detachable head was made in Switzerland in 1830 by Mermot and works as well today as it did 130 years ago. It's not often that you see a prima ballerina doing a passeur at the ripe old age of 110. The Elvis Presley of the 1860s, complete with guitar and built in wink, made where else? In France. Finally, another sprightly hundred-year-old is this acrobat who makes nonsense of Newton's ideas of gravity. And if Mr. Sunley has his way, our friend here will still be performing for another century or two. <laughs> <laughs> 